So I played a map game with my chat, and they conquered the world! Let's take a look. Alright, my call is going to start. Oh. Well, uh, I was just about to say, but, uh, I quit Royal Mini. Alright. They'll give you, like, a nice purple color. Not England? Sure. Hold on one second. I'll give. Troy's movie's mom. Any country besides England and the Equatorial Guinea. <laughs> Oh, also, I forgot, uh, to mention. Uh. You can't pick Somalia, because in Somalia, there's gonna be pirates. And if the pirates attack you, then we all have to start a heist. And, uh. Yeah, if, if, if you don't, if you don't join the heist, then, uh, you lose the territory. Pirates. Australia? Let's go, we can finally start! <laughs> no, that's not a bad pick actually, because it's like way down. Uh alright, and now for my country. Uh I am going to pick I'm I'm feeling India for some reason. Uh Sammy Live, you picked first, so you get to go first. You could do any one of these actions right here. Want to ally with Liverpool Bump? Okay, so if you're allying with a human player, uh, the human player has to say either yes or no. Yes? Alright, so they are allies. I'm gonna make a little list of alliances down here. <laughs> You are now allied to uh, Equatorial Guinea. What would you like to do? Invade France. Oh, things are getting spicy. Okay, so what we do for this army size of UK. <laughs> and then I'm going to do army size of France. 118,000 personnel versus 76,000 personnel. So, you're not going to take the whole country because your yours is less. So, the partitions are basically based off of just my own, like, what I think is fair. Oh, there you go. Alright, uh, Troy's movie's mom. What would you like to do? Invade a country. Which one, though? New Zealand? Okay. So we're going to go to the army size of New Zealand. 15,000. But this one is 60,000 and 29,000 combined. So I think you can take the whole country. I will invade... What will I do, actually? You know what? I'll invade Nepal and Bhutan. So, this turn I'll do Bhutan. Because those things are annoying. I don't even need to pull up the... The, the thing. We, we know India's army is much bigger than Bhutan. Alright. Back to you, Equatorial Guinea, Sammy Live. What would you like to do? Bade for Kina Paso. Uh... How are you gonna get to them? They are... Here. And you are here. You can't even naval invade, because they're landlocked. I'm sorry, but you're gonna have to pick something else. Invade the country above you. Uh, Cameroon? Okay. This should be interesting. 
34,000. Army size of Peck. Memorial Guinea. 2,500. Not good, not good. So, uh, you got beaten pretty badly. So, uh, did I come to save or seeing us how we are up? You know what? I didn't even think of that. I didn't even think of that. Yours plus equatorial guineas. It would be this. I'm going to split it down the middle. Alright. You just uh, gained some land for free from your ally, uh, the mum, and it is your turn. The ally Australia. Okay. Australia is controlled by Troy's Movie's mom. So, uh, Troy's Movie's mom, would you like to ally with the British Empire right now? Yes, I would like to. Okay, let's go. Would like to invade New Guinea. Okay. So, you now have, uh, your army size, oh, I'm gonna need so many now. So you have your army size, plus you have New Zealand, 4,000 people. So, even without New Zealand, you beat them. <laughs> Alright, my turn. I'm obviously probably going to invade Nepal, and again, we don't even need to see the stats. Because Nepal literally has five people living in it. This turn is the first turn that I'm going to be doing the wheel. As a normal turn, a rebellion, or a pirate attack. Okay, Sammy Live, it is your turn. So this is for real this time. Oh! Oh, you... Barely, barely missed that pirate attack. Want to increase my military size. Okay. So what I'm going to do... This number. <clears throat> Normal turn. What would you like to do? You know what? Should I, should I like be playing some music? To make this a little bit more exciting, I'll look for some copyright free. Alright, you want to invade Belgium? Let's go! This is a lot less exciting when I'm just looking up army sizes. <coughs> there you go! All right, normal turn. What would you like to do? Uh, you now have Samoa or Tonga. Sorry, look at that, look at that. Look at that, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> I don't want to invade China just yet. I guess I'll invade Pakistan. 560k for Pakistan. 1,237,117 for India. Boom! All of Pakistan. Can I get Guam? Uh. I guess it's not even on the map. Equatorial Guineas, Guam. To invade the Netherlands. Ooh. Should be interesting. 41k. But the British has 76k. Choice of movies, mom. It is your turn. Let's find Sid. Oh! Our first rebellion. Oh, and it looks like it's gonna be New Zealand that gains independence. New Zealand is no independence. No happy for them though. I like how even though No Oh gosh. Is Guam close enough to Taiwan? 
Guam is pretty close to Taiwan. 169,000. So you beat them. There's been a lot of rebellions going on. Pirate attack? Could this be a pirate attack? <laughs> Not another. Oh my. Okay. The wheel said. Tonga, congratulations on your renewed independence. No freaking way. I'm doing as bad as you, Joy's Movies Mom. And it's the Paul. GG's, I guess, but this is this this hurts my heart. Losing so much land. <laughs> okay, get Vietnam. Would you like to have uh, England join you and split the territory before going along? With English help? Alright, let's do this. 522,000. So, yeah, since you have a quarter of their military size, I'm gonna say you take, like, a quarter of their territory. So just like kind of this, and also you split it with Britain. So, no uh, Pretty, pretty nice empire going on. Invade Luxembourg. I wonder. I don't even need to look at the statistics. New Zealand, taking back that old territory of yours, huh? All right. I mean, we already looked at this before, and you won, so we don't even need to. Can I get another one eight of Vietnam? Sure, I guess. Made Ireland. Good strategy. So, uh, what is Ireland? I know they're not that strong. Troy's movie's mom. What would you like to do? Honka again. <laughs> All right, but they might rebel. Well, you know what? I have a smart idea. I'm gonna ask China for an alliance. All right, and I get the alliance. Let's see, and I can I ally China? Ooh, you got the alliance. You snagged it. Liverpool Mom, what would you like to do? I want to ally with Germany. Good tactic. You got it. GG's. Where's movies, Mom? This is the final trip. Indonesia. Okay. Yeah, there's like half of Indonesia left. I am going to invade Myanmar. 400k? We easily beat them. Okay, sorry for the real quick break right now, but if you could just please subscribe, it would really help us. We are so close to 500 subscribers, so if you could please click that button, that would be really appreciated. Anyway, back to the video. So, uh, if you're already, I'll explain what we're doing today. These anchor icons are the brand new edition. Port City! you control one of these port cities, like Lagos for example, you can attack all the way to Tokyo, you can attack to Vancouver, you can attack to Cape Town, you can attack to Istanbul, it's you can attack any of them from any distance. Oh! Central African Republic is attacking you! So, you crush the foreign invasion, and because your military is double or more their military, you just take over the country. Norway. Oh. I made my point last back up his name. Course movies, mom is in. Let's go for strong. No way! I am not making this up. Enough. This was supposed to be just a joke. <laughs> the most stressful it's ever been. Get Cambodia. Okay, you can do that. 
approximately 100,000 total troops attack Sweden. Yes, because it's a normal turn. We do that. 30,000. And you have 600,000. So yeah, you beat him easily. Yeah. By default, you get the increased military. Viva la revolution. Cambodia is trying to rebel. So you just narrowly suppress the revolt. You keep the territory. Almost 200,000 soldiers. Good output from France, but it seems the British Empire has grown too large to fail. And in that, you will get France. Fiji. I don't even know what any of these islands are, so I'll just give you a random island. NOT A THIRD ONE! Whoop! Better not be AFK now! My car life is in! Liverpool mom! The pirates will take land. Time is ticking. Oh no! So it seems as though Liverpool Mum did not join the heist and beat back the rebels with us. And I think you know what that means. Uh, Sammy Live, it is your turn. Foreign invasion. Gabon will be attacking you, Sammy Live. Uh, not only do you uh, beat back the rebels, but their plan seems to have uh, very, very, very backfired. Boom. No. Choice move. Oh. It's a VIVA LA REVOLUTION! No! Where will you get your water now? It seems as though the water market was too much for Australia to handle. I do have that port city at Mumbai, so I could attack, say, like, Singapore Cape Town. I could attack, like, Peru or something, just for the fun of it. You know what? I might try and just get to buy. You know, attacking like this through the port city? Oh yeah, then they're not beating me. Our empires have become so big that we can just take over whatever we freaking want. Um, so I counted everyone out, um, Liverpool Mum has the most with an astounding eight countries. Oh no. Oh no, Sammy Live! Oh no! Cambodia! There you go. Bye bye. Or an attack. Oh no! This is not good. Spain will be attacking you! Oh! You took over France last time and then Spain was just like, Nah, I can't handle that! So unsurprisingly, not only did you repel the attack, but you kind of Spain. Oh, just barely a revolution. Zealand. Oh, no. 4,000 regular force and 2,065 reserve compared to your 1.1 million. So I think it's fair to say you can crush the revolt. Oh no. 
Dude, if it's China, I'm done. The rate is so hard. Or Saudi Arabia is also really bad for me. But if we can get a small... I was shivering in my boots there! <laughs> <laughs> my skin was shaking, bro! 100,000 for local defense. We did it! <laughs> oh no! JOIN THE HEIST! OR ELSE YOU WILL LOSE TERRITORY! Remember the fate of Liverpool Mum over there. Join. Liverpool Mum has joined the heist. Sammy Live, join the heist. You know what that means? The pirates are expanding their domain. Pack Switzerland. Okay. After Liverpool Mom gets 10 countries, she has to hold them for one more turn. 101,000 plus 49,000. Easily beat by the British Empire. <coughs> and with that, ladies and gentlemen, you have a choice. Would you let Liverpool Mom take the dub? Or will you attack and seek vengeance? Oh, and it looks like Troy's movie's mom is going to be invading British-held France. Oh, this is interesting. And this completely changes the game because... <coughs> Now Liverpool Mom victory isn't so sure. Attack Denmark. Okay. <clears throat> Just don't need France. That's fine. <clears throat> you have 600k. Germany. Okay, that might be a smart move because it's an ally of Liverpool Mom. 181,000. Military size. 1.10 million. <coughs> okay, let me spin. Let me spin the wheel. <coughs> but at the last minute, pirates. ATTACK! If Liverpool Mom, if you don't join this, you throw the game! <clears throat> this is literally the last turn. All it comes down to is Liverpool Mom, join this heist! I joined! I joined the heist! Troy's movie's mom has joined the heist! Pirates attacking! And she wins the game! After having control over 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10 nations! She wins the- It is now once again true that the sun never did set on the British Empire! Congratulations, Liverpool mob! We're winning the first ever map game. This was really fun, you guys. I'm definitely going to do this again sometime. Uh, <clears throat> let's just sink a couple countries into the ocean because it's fun. This was a fun game, you guys. I definitely want to do something uh, else similar to this <clears throat> uh, in the future. All right, thanks for checking out the video. The video, if you liked it, please do subscribe and like the video if you enjoyed this content. All right, Troy's movies out.